Hello and welcome to Shortcuts, the weekly show where I teach you how to do something cool in your Lightworks video editor in two minutes or less. My name is David Winter, I'm a video editor here at Lightworks, and today I want to show you how you can take some video, put it inside some text, inside Lightworks. It's a really cool little trick, but it's deceptively simple to do, so a great one to have in your toolbox. Now, before we get that two minute timer up on the screen, I do want to let you know we have a Shortcuts exclusive offer on right now on people interested in purchasing Lightworks Create. I'll put the details for that down in the description below, but you could save up to 50%. So really great deal. Make sure you check that one out. Now, with that being said, you want to see how you can put some video inside some text. So let's get our two minute timer up on the screen now, and off we go. Okay, so the first thing we need for this is a plain black background. So all we're going to do is right click in our space here, go to make and click video black. There you go, that's added a black clip for us. I know it says empty, but you'll just have to trust me, there is a black clip in there. So we'll just drop that down into the timeline and then head over to the VFX tab. All we want to do now is add a quick text effect. We've made videos covering this before, so I'll link to that down in the description. So we'll give our made up film a quick title here. And the trick to this is really making sure your text is as bold as possible and as big as possible. So that video can really show through. I think this font I'm using is one I downloaded from the internet, as you can use any font that you have installed on your computer system. So with our text in place, we'll go back to the edit tab, right click on the timeline, go to tracks and click add video. Now we've got a second video track, we'll just drag some footage down here from our clip selector onto that track. So back to the VFX tab, click the plus button to add a new effect, head to mix and choose blend. Once that's on your clip, you're going to want to stick around in the settings part of your VFX tab. Click the drop down next to method and simply choose darken from the options. And there you go, you can now see your video through the text. If you stick around in your VFX settings and then click on the video track that your clip is on, you can adjust the opacity of the footage up or down to go back to plain white text or whatever color your text was, or back up to having the full clip showing through. There we go, some video inside some text as promised. Now something I want to note here is that question came to us through Reddit. Now we don't have an official subreddit that's controlled by the company, but there is one that's run by our fan community. And we do try to engage with it where we can to answer questions, post cool guides, things like that. So if you look for r slash lightworks, you'll find that subreddit, great resource, great place to post questions that you have. In terms of official communities, we do also have a forum and this one is run by us. And you can find that on our website, lwks.com and then look for the button for the forum. On there, you've got people that have been editing with Lightworks for decades. You've got years of experience from professional editors. So it's a really excellent place to learn everything about Lightworks, ask any questions you have, and just pick the brain of our really experienced fan community out there. So two great resources for getting help and advice. I'll put links down below in the description for those. Do check them out. They can really help you out on your editing journey. Of course, you can always subscribe to the channel, leave a comment below, and I'll do my best to help you there as well. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video useful, and I'll catch you next time.